So here we have 10.1, finding the vertex, intercepts, and axes of symmetry um, from the graph of a parabola. So it says graph y equals x squared plus 10x plus 21. Plot five points on the parabola. You need to plot the vertex and then two points to the left and two points to the right. Um, click on the graph function button and it'll draw the parabola for you. The first thing I need to do though first is that vertex is this is like the center then I can go ahead and make my table and then graph it okay and with the center here in the middle and then two points to the left and two points to the right okay so for instance here a is negative or is positive 1 B is positive 10 and C is positive 21 so in order for me to find the X value of the center I have to do negative of B value over 2 times the a value. So I get negative 10 over 2, which is negative 5. So negative 5 is going to be my center. So this is negative 5. Now I need two points to the left of negative 5, so like negative 6 and negative 7, and then two points to the right of negative 5, like negative 4 and negative 3. And then all I to do is plug each and every one of these values into this equation. Now you can do parentheses negative 7 squared plus 10 times parentheses around your negative 7 plus 21 and then go back and just change the values for each one. So I'm going to show you what I mean here. So I'm going to do negative 7 squared plus 10 times negative 7 plus 21 and I get zero. Then I'm gonna go back up there and I'm going to change that to a negative six. And I get this Y value. I'm gonna go back up there and change everything to a negative five now. And I get negative four. Go back and change everything to a negative four. I get negative three, and then finally go back and change everything to a negative three, and I get zero. And so then I just plot these points. So I have negative seven and zero, negative six and negative one, two, three, negative five and one, two, three, four, negative four, negative three, and then negative three and zero. And so then you click on that draw button and it will draw the parabola for you. If the graph does not look like a parabola after you've plotted your five points, be sure that your five points are correct. If it starts doing weird things or doing this or making a big, like weird stuff, if it's drawing anything else other than a normal, regular looking parabola, then that means there's something wrong with one or more of your points. Okay, because it knows what the graph should look like. So make sure that you get your points correct. Find the center using this formula, and then find two values to the left of that center x value and two values to the right of that center x value. And that should help you figure out the rest of the problem.